giant lobsters? No thanks. It would take forever to even get them out of the shell. Sometimes you just want something easy. Something like comfort food. And in Atlanta, there are cooks, bakers, and even popsicle makers taking crowd-pleasing favorites to a whole nother level. So get comfortable, because this is Get Delicious, Comfortably Young. Comfort food is the kind of food that you can either eat with your fingers or not. Comfort food? Uh, southern food. Uh, anything like fried chicken. Grandma's macaroni and cheese or, you know, scattered, smothered and covered. Something with a lot of carbohydrates in it. Anything cheese-based. Definitely uh, baked potatoes or fries. Milk-based, actually, ice cream, milkshakes. No salads involved. You can't beat pimento cheese and a corn dog. <laughs> yeah, those are my comfort foods. Cheese involvement and pork and bacon. Yeah, that's about it, yeah. I've been a cook for years, and I know some stuff about comfort food. But the thing is, not everyone has the same idea about what that means. Oh, gosh. Um, <laughs> I don't know if I could answer that. Food that you think of from your childhood, what you grew up on, what your grandma cooked. Stuff I think of around Thanksgiving. Something homey and probably filled with fat. You, you ought to feel real nice at the end of it. You ought to just enjoy yourself with no guilt. And, you know, a lot of people can feel the guilt. Obviously, I don't. To me, comfort food fills up more than just your stomach. It brings back memories or makes your day better. It warms you up in the winter and cools you down in the summer. Comfort food makes you feel good. Now, I don't mean good like you could outrun a car or fight a monster. Whatever comfort food is, it's not great for your waistline. And take this youngster. Looks like he could safely skip a meal or three, doesn't he? <laughs> well, that just leaves more for the rest of us. Here in Atlanta, there are folks taking hot dogs, hamburgers, pizza, donuts, pancakes, popsicles, and more, and elevating them to high art with the best ingredients and a lot of love. This isn't stuff concocted in a factory test kitchen somewhere, so don't you dare call it junk food. These are some of my favorite dishes in town. And we're gonna fire up the Get Delicious Copter and go try them all. So loosen your belt a few notches, because this show is all about comfort.